Stanford University. Three, two, one, go! Tonight we have the final presentations for ME210, Introduction to Mechatronics. The students in the class have built robots that will compete against each other. The robots are designed to take tokens, which are poker chips, from one location to other locations on a playing field. We'll see them get a little confused at times. They might get stuck in the corner. They might lose track of where they're going. The robot that has deposited the most tokens is declared the winner and goes on to the next round of competition. Michelle Botman and Team Robama. Well, these are mechanical engineering students learning enough electronics and enough computer science to be dangerous in the real world. Our robot's called the Jitterbug because every once in a while it veers off of the tape and just does a little dance. The key difference, I guess, between ours and other robots is that we have the ability to dispense into three bins at once. Our robot is named Bit Romney. Our design intention was that we would be able to get to the line real quick and then deliver one chip to each bin. That was our idea. It's unclear whether we're going to be able to make good on that because we had to turn our speeds down a little bit. I think the most important thing the students learn in this class is that they already possessed the skills to design devices that incorporate microcontrollers and software and sensors and actuators. A lot of hard work, not all of it pleasant, goes into building and testing and debugging and refining a machine like this. But when it's finally all working, and we get to see the students compete and celebrate and show off what they've built, everybody leaves here feeling literally pretty euphoric. Where else do you have engineers working on something surrounded by people cheering? For more, please visit us at stanford.edu.